Hey guys, on to today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how to free up some space that you may see that doesn't make sense. So let's say on Final Cut Pro you deleted a bunch of projects plus videos and you still go into your storage and you guys see this. So maybe you guys see movies, okay, and then you guys see other one terabyte. This actually other might still be movies. It's just depends where it is, okay? So first of all, we're going to clean up all Final Cut Pro stuff from your computer and this will significantly change so let's go right into your finder on your finder you guys will see something like this on the side okay so going to that house icon whatever the name this would be whatever name your mac is doesn't matter if you have an imac macbook pro same thing from there just going to movies okay now all of you will have the same type of deal and you guys will see this final cut backups and untitled on backups, you know the other that we were looking at? Let me just show you again, right here. This one terabyte, this would actually classify as the other. Okay, so uh, you guys should delete stuff that you don't need. Okay, so for Final Cut backups, I actually, I could actually delete this whole thing, but I want to show you what's inside of it. So these are backups of your videos on Final Cut Pro. So if I right click on any of these and go into show package contents, I will see this stuff. So inside of here, I will see videos that I've already made from before. Okay, so these are projects. I can go right into them and look at the project. Now this takes space. It doesn't take too much space, but it takes space that you probably don't need. Okay, so if you can get rid of your backups, I would do so. Um, let me just go back here again. So make sure you're in movies and right here, Final Cut Backups. On the backups, I'm just gonna trash it all, okay? And then delete it. Make sure, by the way, I have Final Cut Pro open. I'm just gonna quit it for now. Um, and that's the very first thing you guys should do. Sorry, didn't mention that. Um, and then you can trash it. Empty your trash. Always, always remember to empty your trash. If you're not sure about something, don't empty it. Um, from there, we can just go into Untitled, okay, so just go back on that, and right here, Show Package Contents again, so I'm right-clicking to get these options, by the way, and uh, to right-click, you can press Control and then just click, or you can activate the right-clicking on your mouse, or on your, um, depends what you guys have, you have a trackpad, you can just tap with two fingers, that's your right-click. Anyways, um, from here, you guys can just go right into here, and you guys can see all this, and you can select and delete all that you want. So for me, um, I just want to show you two things that you guys shouldn't delete. So from here, you have projects and you have some folders that are not projects. For example, transcoded media. Don't delete that folder itself. You guys will have stuff here that takes a lot of space on your computer, other stuff that doesn't really. And um, you also have shared items. Okay, you guys will have a bunch here. So I will delete stuff from here, but I'm not gonna delete the folder itself, just in case, okay? So I'm gonna start deleting all the ones that said untitled, because I know these are projects, and it says project right there anyways. So I can just press Command Delete to delete them, or I can just right click. So I'm gonna right click and move, and I can just move this to trash. That's an option. Uh, this one, I know it's, um, I know it's a project because of the title, okay? So you guys should know your titles and know what a project is and what isn't. So I know these are projects, um, except for render files, obviously that's not a project, those are render files, so don't touch that. And you guys will kind of get a sense what you shouldn't touch by the end of me deleting the ones that I don't need. Don't need that, don't need that. I probably don't even need that, but I'm gonna leave that for now. Um, and you guys should, be left over just with these. And under these folders, you guys should go into them and delete what you guys don't need from in there. Um, in my case, I don't need, let's see, let's see, let's just read this over very quickly. I don't need anything. So bang, delete it. What else? Shared items, same thing. Shared items, usually I don't need anything from there. Rendered files, thumbnails, same thing. Don't need anything from there. So I'm deleting everything I don't need. Pick that up, 
especially don't get anything from there. So to select everything, I'm just pressing Command A and then Command Delete to delete it. It's gonna be a bunch right there. High quality media. Again, don't need all this. So it's done. And I just cleaned up a lot of stuff. So under original media, so hold on, on original media right here. That's the last folder I usually leave. And that's because some of these videos I do need. They're the ones that I choose and I want them to, I want them to be writing Final Cut already. Um, so I have a lot of titles and stuff like that and pre-made videos that I, I want them to be there. I don't want to erase those. But I do want to re erase all the other clips that I use for every other video. So I'm going to press Command A to select everything. And then I'm just going to press Command and then click on the ones that I don't want to delete. Because I know these are titles and I'm going to reuse them. And I just don't want to import them again. I just want to leave them in Final Cut Pro. If you guys want to clean this up nice and clean and just re-import whatever title, titles you're doing, stuff like that, then you can just go right ahead and just delete every single thing from here, which I highly recommend unless you need to work on one of these videos. But this video today is just about cleaning up Final Cut Pro. And... Um, I think I deleted, I think, I think I did everything right. I'm not 100% sure if I'm missing something, but that's okay. I can always re-import it to Final Cut Pro. So I'm just going to delete it from here. Yeah, and I'm left over with some titles there. Uh, so that's in the original media. Again, you guys could have just deleted everything. I'm just going to double check these if they are empty. Because right here is where you guys actually take up a lot of space shared items and lastly transcoded media high quality and there's nothing in there perfect now final cut pro is finally nice and clean you can always go into 10 files and then just delete those and that's it um right now we're in movies might as well go into if you have any other programs that you run and you may have videos that you don't longer need so for me, it's all these. I probably don't need anything that's converted either, but there's nothing in there. And that's it. So I can empty my trash bin. That will take some time, depending how many, uh, you know, if it's been a few years since you de haven't deleted your stuff, it's going to take quite some time. As you can see, I have 15,000, um, I wouldn't say videos. It's not all videos in there, but they are folders. They're files that I just don't need. And most of you don't need that. Now, next time that you guys open up Final Cut Pro, you guys will see a lot of question marks in there and you just have to delete all those. Um, if you already deleted them from Final Cut Pro, then you guys won't see that. But I'll show you what I'm talking about in just one second. I just need this to empty out. And uh, while that's emptying out, I'm just gonna show you the other folders that you guys have. So you have motion projects. Um, depends what programs you're running again. So I have these programs that are running and I may have to delete some stuff from here as well. But this isn't part of Final Cut Pro, so I'm not even gonna go into it. Now, motion templates. Most of you that have Final Cut Pro have motion templates. And remember, you can also just delete stuff from right in here, compositions. Um, but it depends, right? Depends what you guys work in. Um, for Final Cut Pro, you're basically looking always on this untitled, okay? Unless you guys named it. And then you have Final Cut Pro backups, which you do want to delete, okay? Uh, for most of you. If you care about your backups, then you don't, obviously. But I suggest always backing up your files before doing this and knowing what you're deleting. Right now, Final Cut Pro, finally, my trash bin's empty. So they are 100% deleted. I'm going to show you, opening up Final Cut Pro trial, and show you guys what I have right here. So let me just click OK. You guys don't have the trial version don't worry about it you guys won't get this message i have the trial version for now and that's why okay so see these videos right here these are the leftovers those are the ones i didn't delete that's because they're titles i'm gonna use later on and see all of these it's just because i haven't deleted them from my final cut pro library and that's why i see them right there other than that you guys will not see anything like this uh if you guys do just select them all so i can just drag select all this and then just command delete 
and then it's just gonna trash everything. Usually, usually you're able to do this without a problem. Uh, it shouldn't take that long. Right, right now it took quite a bit actually. It uh, usually does it right away. But again, uh, depends how many videos are running and everything. Um, yes, yeah, so right now it's just not letting me do some stuff just because it's previewing the videos. So all these are missing files, obviously, because we just delete them from the back end where you guys should always delete afterwards, okay? So I know you guys maybe have deleted stuff from here, but that's why we had all that storage. And after I do this, actually before the windows, my storage, although I this is right there, I should have a lot more space. So let me just refresh this. Storage. There we go. That's a huge, huge difference. So remember guys, we had in other under other we had a terabyte. Right now we only have half, less than half. Right now, in 415. And in movies, that went down a little bit. Uh, that actually surprises me. Everything was connected to other. However, movies did go down quite a bit. And um, if you want to get rid of more stuff, it's probably my Photos app. Okay. Um, there, I, yeah, yeah. It's on, for sure, it's under Photos app, under another category. And also iTunes. iTunes does keep your files um, under the other and under movies, especially in movies. So iTunes, going to iTunes, delete videos that you have from there. If you guys want to further clean this up. Other than that, you, right now you guys cleaned up a bunch. Just have to finish up with Final Cut Pro and that's about it. Anyways, if you guys have any comments or questions, you can write them down here below in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.